Hi, I'm Blair Gilbert here for Gilbert's Pro Hardware in St. Clair Shores, Michigan and MrHardware.com talking about the scourge of bed bugs. Here is the order you really need to follow if you're going to get rid of these little nuisance pests. First, diatomaceous earth. It's a powder, it's sharp, it kills the bugs. This has to be dusted around the room, put in the receptacles. Then, you need to create a trap so that the bed bugs can't get off the bed frame and onto the carpet and continue to run. We take a simple caster cup. It's an inexpensive, easy to find trap. We put the diatomaceous earth around the caster cup. We put the bed leg in it. The bed bugs can only crawl, they don't fly. So when they come off the bed, they have to go through the diatomaceous earth. You have to do the rails of the bed, bed frame, Anything that's stationary that the bugs can crawl on and use as a bridge to get to another location. Don't spare this stuff. It's not expensive. Then, pesticide. Either we're using a permethrin or deltamethrin. Both are excellent bed bug killers. We spray everything that's not moving. As you spray the bedding, the mattress, the box spring, the little buggers are running for mercy. They're going to run into the diatomaceous earth. It's important that diatomaceous earth is in all its key locations first, then the pesticides. We're talking about bed bug killing. Now there's numerous ways to do it. Here's one way I've been taught that's working the best for my customers. Diatomaceous earth is a fine powder, but to a bug, it's like slate or shale. It gets into their joints. It cuts into their body. It kills them. It's so fine though, it doesn't bother most of us. They say to wash your hands uh, before uh, eating any food or doing anything so you can be careful with it when when once you're done with it when we go to treat a room the first thing we want to do is go around the perimeter of the room with this earth it's just the dust and we shake it on get on the baseboard and the carpeting and what happens is we're going to come back and we are going to spray the bed well what's going to happen is these smart little devils are going to make a run for it what happens is when they make a run for it and they run into this barrier it's going to kill them that way. Another important thing to do is they love receptacles because that's a safe haven for them. So you squirt that in there and you can put that back together once you're done. But the point is, is you have to do all the receptacles too. It's kind of funny, but they love that. It's a good place for them to hide. Then the other place we go, we come to the bed frame. We put the dust in on the rails underneath the box springs and stuff. So when they come down, they can't get out of there. And then the last place is take something like a dish. We found a soap dish that suits us. So we put the powder in the soap dish around the perimeter, get a nice layer all the way around it. Stuff's not very expensive, six, seven dollars a can. So now we take and we put this under all four legs of the bed. We leave that there. So now if the bugs try getting on or off the bed, they can't because they're not flyers, they're runners. So, We've dusted the perimeter of the room. We've dusted the rails of the bed. We can also dust the frames. But now what we do is we use one or two different products. Enforcer Bug Maxis is a very broad range insecticide. What makes it good is the fact that it's delta methrin, 0.03%. I use this outside for spiders. I use it for ants in the tree. I use this a lot of places. It's clear, it's odorless, very strong, very long lasting. So then I take this product, and this is a waterborne spray. I'm not going to do it, but we spray the bed. Then we get this mattress all sprayed. We're going to take and we're going to put it up against the wall where we've already done the diatomaceous earth around the perimeter. And then we spray the bottom of the mattress. Then we spray the back springs, both sides, lean them up against the wall. So now these bugs are running for mercy. There's no way to go because we've already used the earth for the perimeter of the room. Delta methrin is good. You might not always be able to find it. Eaton makes a product that's very good. Uses a pyrethrin. Another very good, broad range, full spectrum insecticide. This, is, this does everything. This is also waterborne. I can also use this all over mattresses, box springs, and so forth. So you're trying to get rid of bed bugs. You can't attack them lightly. You have to go after them full speed ahead. So you dust the perimeter, then you spray your materials. You can even get bags that you can put a mattress in a bag. So you go to another room, sterilize this room, suffocate these insects in a bag, and then in, uh, a day later you can pull them back out and you're in pretty darn good shape. Then I rewash all the bedding and away you go.